ایز مبتدا المدرس واقف ان شاء الله somebody is sitting brother who is sitting المهندس جالس اور الولد جالس are you with me brothers okay now something is very big albaitu kabirun you can say you know when you drive down uh, bayview and uh, uh, you know lawrence you see all those monster homes you know <laughs> then when you are driving you can say haz albaitu kabirun this house is a big you know albaitu kabirun okay fine brothers and sisters something is old Huh? <laughs> yes, you can say Arajalu. <laughs> the man is old. Yes. Al Kitabu Kadimun, Al Kalamu Kadimun, Al Sariru Kadimun, whatever. But it will be with Al. Huh? Because you're using Muftada now, bringing in Muftada. Very good, brothers. Something is new. At Talibu Jadidun. The student is new. Huh? Or al mudarisu jadidun, or al kalamu jadidun, al kitabu jadidun, al kursiu jadidun. You can say anything you want. You will be able to use simple sentences now, brother, and you will be able to make your own sentences. Huh? So, brothers and sisters, al jumlatul ismiyatu. What did I say? Nominal sentence. Al jumlatul ismiyatu has got two parts. In English, we say. Subject and predicate. In Arabic we say, Muftida and Khabar. They are both always marfu. They will end with a Dhamma. Uh, they will end with a Dhamma. Uh, and the Muftida is most of the time definite. And Khabar most of the time. Uh, yeah. Sometimes it can be definite. Most of the time indefinite. Are you with me brothers and sisters? Now, can you see here Muhammadun Rasulullah. What is what kind of sentence is this? Jumla ismiya. What kind of a sentence is this? Because this started with Muhammad. This is not Jumla ismiya. This is not uh, you know Jumla ismiya here. Okay, uh, this is ismiya, but we'll learn later on, inshallah. This is not Jumla ismiya. Okay, but this is Jumla ismiya. Muhammadun. So where is Mubtada? It has got tanwin. Is it definite or indefinite? Definite. definite. Why it is definite? Because it is a proper noun. Name. Huh? Name. Fine, brother. How about this? Allahu. Definite. definite. What is this? Jumla ismiya. What is this? Muqtada. Oh, where is the khabar of this? Ghafuru. Allahu ghafuru. Allah is most forgiving. Huh? And here... I'm not going in detail because in the next lessons we'll go in detail. But Muhammad is the Rasul, is the messenger. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So, to wind up, brother, in Arabic, the nouns decline. Are you with me? Their nouns decline. They can end with a Dhamma, or they can end with a Fata, or they can end with a Kasra. If they end with a Dhamma, we call it Marfu. If they end with a Fataha, we call it Mansu. If they end with a Kasra, we call it Pajur. Huh? So, in other words, it's Dun, Dan, and Din. Again, say it loudly. Say it loudly. Dan din. Now, if I say dun, what will you say to me? It's marfu. What will you say? Marfu. If I say dan, what will you tell me? It's mansu. If I say din, huh? are you with me? Again, I tell you, if I say dun, if it is dan, huh? if it is din, mansu. If I say dun, then it is marfu. And if I say dun, it's mansu. And when I say din, it's majru. 
One more time. If I say dun, it's marfu. If I say dun, it's mansu. And if I say din, therefore, dun 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 din din, dun 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 din din, dun 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 din din, dun 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 din din. So that is what it is, brother. Dun 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 din din, dun 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 din din, dun 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 din din, dun 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 din din. So what I am saying? Marfu, Mansub, and Majroor. Will you remember this, brother? Marfu, Mansub, Majroor. This terminology you should memorize tonight. Huh? Because this is how we will be pointing out to the words. Are you with me? It's easy, brother. My last advice. If you did not understand thoroughly, don't worry. We will repeat it again. And you will, inshallah, get it. Huh? So do not be, you know, don't say to yourself, I have become old. Or I have become old. Don't say that, brother. Age is not the barrier. If you have a will, huh? if you have a determination, Allah will make it easy. Okay, are you with me? So tomorrow we'll revise everything. And then the way we are going, going, brothers and sisters, soon we'll be in the lesson four. And in lesson four, Majroor will come. What will come? Majroor will come in lesson four. But inshallah, we'll go slowly, slowly, and we'll keep on revising. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Brothers and sisters, we'll start our session. Uh, I would like to repeat a couple of things, uh, just as a revision. In Arabic language, brothers and sisters, the noun declines. We call it dec declension of noun. Uh, in other words, it's Muarab. It can have three cases. <clears throat> it can be nominative, accusative, and genitive. I did not say this yesterday. But then it may confuse you. But it is very simple. Nominative case means it is marfu. Huh? And then accusative case means it's mansu. And genitive case means it's majru. So it should not be confusing. We, won't, we will get used to marfu, mansu and majru more than anything else. Huh? In other words, the noun can... And Muhammad Dun, that's why I said Dun, then it can end in Dun, that's why I said Dun, and it can 